What's up fellow gamers, Lefty Lucy here. It's time for our Emperor Edition. This is episode number 21 and this episode is going to be all about Emperor PvP. So all of, the, all of the players in this episode have Emperor and this episode is just going to show you just how plain ridiculous Emperor PvP is. Just ridiculous. Look, we just dropped a meteor. Now we're going to spin to win. Look, we already have our ultimate. There's a soul tether. More spins. Bodies. Everywhere. <laughs> Get ready for this episode. If you've never played as an, as an emperor, this will give you an idea of how crazy it is. So here's number 10. A llama snack bar. I feel like I want to say it. A llama snack bar. I like that name. Running the night blade. Running the stam night blade. He's just going to go right into this group of like 30 DC. Drop some caltrops. Put some vigor on. There goes bats. Using uh, Devouring Swarm and Spin to win. Just Steel Tornado and everything just drops. Bash these reses real quick. Throw down some Caltrops, ambush in, Steel Tornado. Bodies everywhere. Insane. All right, number nine. This is Galvanized G2K. This clip's a little obnoxious because no, no one even really attacks him. They let the Emperor Sorcerer free cast on him. He dropped a meteor right there. He killed two or three people already. You can see the alliance points down in the bottom left. So one thing about Emperors, while, while, we're, while, we're, while we're just watching Galvanize do his, do his just burst combo on everyone, sitting here, sitting in the mines, throwing down the Magic Death, Delicious Curse, throwing down frags, throwing out more Magic Deaths. But anyway, so as an Emperor, you have extra HP, MP, stamina, extra HP regen, MP regen, stamina regen. You have extra ultimate regen, which would, that's what really makes it insane. Watch these clips. Watch how fast they get, watch how fast they get ultimate. The Galvanize has the Dawnbreaker. He's not throwing the Dawnbreaker down, but he's got it, man. Look at him just taking, he's taking a meteor. He's taking wrecking blows. Doesn't even touch his health. Doesn't even touch his health. His health is probably insane. His magic is probably insane. I wish we could see it. He's on console though, he's on PS4, so you can't really see it. Drop a proc frag and a meteor, or sorry, and a Dawnbreaker, that dude's down. Cancel his reds with a fragment. Streak through this dude. Here's a magic death for you, delicious curse. Hit him with an Endless Fury. Throw a frag at him, a couple Endless Furies. Endless Fury still stinks even when you're an Emperor. All right, hit him with a, hit him with a proc frag, he's done. Just a free casting Emperor Sork. All right, number eight, we got Ifo Calor. Play in the Nightblade on the Xbox. Now he's running a stamp build, he's running two hand, dual wield, he's going into clouding swarm, and he's doing some steel tornado. The spinning and the winning. They go hand in hand, you can't spin without winning, especially if you're an emperor. So look at him, he just, he puts the heat on, goes into bats, takes a step back, he's got his ultimate back, right now he just got his bats back, throw down his caltrops, go into the bats. Oh he wasn't using clouding swarm, he's actually using, um, he was just stealth before. My bad, my bad. He is actually using Devouring Swarm, which is the better option for Emperor if you ask me, because you're putting on all this heat and you're also healing yourself. Look at this damage that he does to people though. He just ambushes in with bats up, steel tornado, and everyone just drops. Look at it, 17 players dead now, 18. It's not even, it's not even, look at the bodies everywhere. Just one dude, solo defending this keep. This is obnoxious, this is ridiculous. <laughs> all right. Number seven, number seven, we got Nigel the Great, also playing a Nightblade, but he's on PC and he's running a Magicka build. We got Clouding Swarm here, Clouding Swarm, right? Pretty sure this one's Clouding Swarm. Look at that, we just killed a couple people right there. Now we're gonna go up here, we got bats again, let's go into the Clouding Swarm again and we're doing Sap Essence. Sap Essence and Clouding Swarm. Look, they're already falling down, the bodies. All right, we do our ultimate, then we drop back. We do our ultimate, then we drop back, and then we get bats right back up, and we jump right back in. Look at that. Look, we already have bats again. This is, we've had bats back to back to back to back now. Look at this. Just ambush in, use the bats, use the sap essence. Ambush in, sap essence. Oh, we don't have our bats yet. Hold on, just, just give me a couple of seconds. Just give me a second. All right, ambush in. We got bats now? Yeah, yeah we do. Let's just go back into bats. Seems like a good idea to me. We got Proxy Dead on. That's blowing people up too. Proxy Dead, bats on. Proxy Dead blew up on that dude in the back. Bodies all over the floor. Bottles, bodies all over the stairs. Just everywhere. All right, here's our Zerg bomb. Our first Zerg bomb. We got J Boy. Look, he's attacking this one dude on his Sork on PS4. Oh my God! Look at all those people. Look, he takes a step back, and then he's like, "Wait a second, I'm an Emperor. I'm gonna throw a Magic Debt, a Valicious Curse. I'm gonna jump in here and pop a Dawnbreaker. The Magic Debt blows up. Look at the bodies." 
<laughs> he just put all of them on the ground in a couple seconds. Streaking back and forth, not really sure what to do next. <laughs> They're everywhere, all over the floor. <laughs> all right, number six, test your might. Finally, we got a DK here. What's he doing? He's running dual wield. He's running dual wield. He's got, he's got his, uh, his dragon leaps and his steel tornado. Dragon leap and steel tornado. The DK Emperor is nasty because that, that extra HP, MP, and stamina combined with the extra ult gen with a battle roar passive, leap on him. Get our resources and our health back. Spin to win. Reflect this meteor. Get out of my face. I don't want that meteor. Look, I got my leap back. Leap on him. Spin to win. The damage is just insane. The leap spin to win combo, you take so many people out like that, especially if you're Emperor. Just crazy. Look, we're just playing with these dudes. We're line of sighting on the edge of this, uh, on the edge of this rock. Leap in, spin to win. That's like three kills right there. Nothing. It's nothing. You know, it's whatever. We're just doing. We do this all day. One wrecking blow, two wrecking blow. He's dead. Oh look, someone's ultimate using an ultimate on me. I really don't even care. I'm like full health. Look, I need some resources. I fell down here. Just let me leap back up. I got my resources back from that from that ultimate. Spin to win to finish that dude off that fell off to the left. Run back up the cliff. This is just this is just child's play. Look, we do this. I can do this in my sleep. Look at this. Spin to win a couple times. I gotta leap up. Let's leap on this dude. Spin to win. He's dead. Whatever. Don't care. Look at all the people attacking us. It doesn't even matter. It's not even phasing us. It's not even phasing us, dude. Spin to win. Oh, I got hit by a wrecking blow. I don't even feel it though. I'm still full health. Spin to win a couple times. Leap on that dude. He's done. Reflect the meteor. Don't care about your meteor. You can take it right back. We've got Igneous Shield to transfer our magic into stamina. And with that combined with the dragon leaps, we basically have no resource problems. Honestly, look, we're low on resources. Let's just do a dragon leap. Look, we're back to half stamina. It doesn't, it doesn't even matter, dude. It's just... I, we'll just stop it there. You get the point with that clip. <laughs> All right, number five. We got Pele, man. Running the Stam Stork on PC. Gonna jump into this outpost, this keep. Oh, what's going on here? Look at this. Look at all the people. Look at all the people. He's got bats and steel tornado. Look at the DPS in the top left. 49,000 DPS we peaked at. We peaked at 49,000 DPS. That is... Look at, look, at the, look at all the damage just going off on the left. There's so many people here. Eventually, we're going to get taken out. It doesn't even matter, though. We did an insane amount of damage and took a bunch of people out just by ourselves. That's the kind of stuff you can do as Emperor. All right, Abdurrahman playing the Nightblade on PS4. He's got a stand build right here. I like this clip because he's, not, he's actually not using AoEs. The only AoE he has is his Sphere. Look at this group right here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Is this like, I think this is like between 8 and 10 people that he's fighting. And he's going to focus one at a time and do single target abilities. Hit him with the surprise attacks. Hit him with the soul harvest. Look how fast he gets back soul harvest. Look, we just used it, right? Ambush in on this dude. Soul harvest is back already. That dude's done. Ambush in on this dude. Hit him with the soul harvest. Ambush right back on him. Bash that res. See, this guy, this guy actually knows what he's doing, man. He's, he is just putting these guys to waste with single target abilities. This is, this is an impressive clip to me. This is really impressive. Go into stealth, just for a second, dodge some abilities, do some medium attack weaving, some dodge rolls, pick our target, here's our healer, soul harvest on him, surprise attack, he's done, healer's down. Who are we going on next? This dude right here, James GTO, oh he went into bats, he's like screw this, we used a fear, we're gonna get on this dude, he's trying to res, medium attack weave, surprise attack, he's done, this dude right here just standing around, you can't just be standing around right now, they're focused on resing. And we're focused on killing. Look, we took a dragon leap. We're like 80% health. It doesn't even matter. Keep our vigors up. Use a fear right there. Ambush. Surprise attack. Done. Ambush. Soul harvest. Surprise attack. Done. One more. Look, he's just going to stand there blocking. He's like, please. Please. No, please. Please. He's done. Bodies everywhere. Nice clip right there, man. All right. Number three for this week, we got Jar Jar. Jar Jar Mercs playing on in his Templar. On the Xbox, he's playing his Magic of Build Templar. He's got a lot of heat right here. He's leading the charge for his group. There's there's some friendlies here, but he's going to go into Devouring Swarm and use the Puncturing Sweeps. Get some Repentance up. Take all of those bodies and turn them into Stamina and Health. The Puncturing Sweeps is also going to heal us. The Clouding Swarm is also going to heal us. We basically are invincible as Templar. Um, as a Templar Emperor, while we're using Clouding Swarms and Puncturing Sweeps. And then we've got Repentance to top it all off. So the healing is just out of control. And then we have Breath of Life when we really get in a pinch. But look at, look at all the kills. Just, just a couple bats and a couple Puncturing Sweeps. And, and it's nothing. They can't do anything. They need, like, they need like 30 more healers to outheal this damage. 
more bodies on the ground. They're getting some reses. Doesn't really matter. We're just gonna wipe through them. We're just gonna sweep right through them. They're moving out this way. All right, that's fine. That's fine. Throw out a cleanse. Break that CC. Go into bats. Go into the puncturing sweeps. Look, we already have a Dawnbreaker. We're in bats and we got Dawnbreaker up. Those guys are dead. Repent. All of those guys repent. All right, you guys get the point. You guys get the point with that clip. Look at this. Look at this Zerg bomb though. This might be my favorite Zerg bomb I've ever seen. Because, because he's an Emperor. Look at the crazy stuff he can do. Look, he's telling his buddy, put your siege away. I'm going to throw down some real siege. Emperors also get extra siege damage. Look at this. Watch. He's got a Covenant Cold Stone Trebuchet for some ultra burst. Drop that. Drop a Meteor. Watch, watch down below. Watch his, watch his ultimate. Look, Dawnbreaker. Use it. Dawnbreaker. Use it. He just used three ultimates back to back. Meteor, Dawnbreaker, Dawnbreaker. That ultimate generation. Look at the bodies everywhere. If that is a Zerg bomb, if I've ever seen one. Absolutely out of control. One guy dropping three ultimates. All right. <laughs> Sorry. We got Durgons here for number two. Look at all the people. Look at all the people following him. Durgons is running. He's running his Magicka Templar. He's got a lot of heat right here. He's on the PS4. Throw down some Spear Shards. Try and stop these guys. Slow him down right here. We're just going to bring him all the way up here. One Breath of Life takes us from like 10% to 80. There's the Bats and the Spear Shards. Look at them scattering like cockroaches. They don't know what to do. They're dropping another Bats. We just went into two Bats right there. Repent. A couple guys repent right there. Get the Entropy Jesus Beam right there. We got feared out of it though. Got robbed of that kill. Going to cancel this res with some Puncturing Sweeps. Take a Meteor. Cleanse the Slow. This dude's trying to res right here. Throw down Spear Shards, stop the res. Oh, we didn't stop it, but it doesn't matter. He's dead, because we went into Bats and the Spear Shard spam. Just out of control. Entropy, Bats, Spear Shards. Look at the bodies everywhere. You're trying to res? Nope. No, sir. Well, he got it off again. All right, we drop a Meteor on him. He's dead. He's just done. Entropy, Spear Shard. Look, you're trying to res? Stop it. Just, just don't even try. Just don't even try. Oh, you leaped on me? That's funny. I didn't even feel it. I'm full health still. Throw down the Spear Shards. Got the Dark Flare, Jesus Beam combo on that dude. He's done. This dude's wrecking blowing. Dark Flare, Jesus Beam. Hey. Hey. Stop it. Stop it. This DK right here. I got my eye on him. We throw down the bats. Look. I told you I got my eye on you. Where are you going? He's done. <laughs> Spear Shards, Puncturing Sweeps. This is just ridiculous, man. Emperors are ridiculous. Look at that crazy repentance. A tri-level repentance. All right. Number one. Number one M clip goes to Spike Spiegel playing the Dragon Knight on PS4, also using single target abilities. He's running a, look at that Dragon Leaf. He's running a two hand sword and board Stam DK build. For his DPS, he's using Puncture. So he's using single target DPS. Look at that, he just took two meteors to the face and didn't even really care. Got some nice damage mit mitigation while blocking. Just gonna leap on these dudes, get our resources back, and also do- That's our only AoE, is the leap. So that's our AoE DPS, and we're gonna finish people off with our punctures. Look at all the- look at- look at all the tanking we're doing right here. That is tanking, right there. We had a Jesus Beam going off, we had a Soul- uh, Soul Assault going off. This dude's almost dead in the back. Give him a puncture, he's done. Alright, now that we're done tanking, we're gonna actually put the heat on. Look, these guys are demoralized. They just gave him- They just gave Spike Spiegel everything that they had, they couldn't kill him. We're gonna leap, we're gonna- we got two kills right there. Puncture the dude that survived the leap. Reverb right there. Knock this dude down. Puncture him a couple times. He's done. We're just tanking. Like, they're, they're, they're not even doing anything to us. Look, we got ultimates in our face. Use some Igneous. Igneous shield. Leap on him. Puncture. He's done. Just one by one taking him out. We just mess with that dude real quick. Throw it on the Caltrops. Turn back around. Get back on the dude we were messing with. Look at it. Look. He can do whatever he wants. It doesn't, he doesn't even have to focus on anyone. Because he just tanks so hard. Leap on this werewolf. Puncture him a couple times. He's done. Whatever. I don't even... It's just... We don't even have to try, man. Crit charge on this guy. Try and get a wreck and blow off. We can't get it off. He keeps dodging it. Reflect that meteor with defensive posture. Break this CC. I need some more stamina. I'll do a leap. I got my battle roar. That'll take care of it. Got a kill right there. Throw down the Caltrops. What do we got here? This dude's trying to sneak away. Reverb. Kill him. Get in this dude's face with the crit rush. I'm telling you, these guys are, they're, they're just straight demoralized. One wreck and blow, two wreck and blow, done. Use a Dawnbreaker on this group, drop some more Caltrops. Get some Vigors up, get some Igneous Shield going. Body's going down, body's going down. Puncture a couple times around this dude. He's still alive? What? Leap. That dude's done. This dude, one puncture, two puncture. Reverb, stop healing. Puncture, he's done. Look, this dude's, he's just, 
They're just done. A couple Regan blows. They're just done. This is a nine minute clip. He, he, he beats on those dudes for nine straight minutes with single target abilities. That is out of control. All right, guys. <laughs> I hope you like this episode. I've never been an emperor myself, so it's really cool to see emperor gameplay in from their point of view. That's just out of control. You can do some crazy stuff as emperor. All right, guys. Make sure you check the description below to find out who is all featured in this episode. Check their YouTube channels. And also, you can find the details to submit your clips to be featured in upcoming episodes. I'll see you guys next week.